ABC News 4 in Charleston. This is ABC News 4 at 11. Good evening and thank you for joining us for News 4 at 11. Parts of Berkeley County were under a tornado warning tonight. Take a look at this photo Thomas Lambert took. It's from Lake Moultrie and while it looks like a tornado, and most likely is a low hanging scud cloud. We're going to bring in our meteorologist, Cherston Clark, to explain the difference. Cherston, that looks an awful lot like a tornado to me. <laughs> How do you know it's not? Yeah, so it's very important to differentiate that scud cloud from a tornado. So if we can go ahead and pop that picture back up. So let's take a look at it. You can tell that there's just no rotation with it. And with scud clouds, they're typically irregular. Um, they are typically also uh, detached from the bottom of that thunderstorm, the bottom of a cumulonimbus or a cumulus cloud. Uh, so this picture is very deceiving, uh, but this is just a scud cloud. There was no rotation with this one, uh, but of course we're going to wait for a confirmed report uh, from that storm earlier on tonight. But that right there, it looks to be a, a scud cloud just because of that lack of rotation. Otherwise, things are finally looking a little bit calmer. Still hanging on to a couple light showers up towards Georgetown and Williamsburg County as the rest of us looking at dry, but we'll continue to monitor radar. We can't rule out maybe another shower or two. Otherwise, 72 right now in Georgetown, 73 in Monk's Corner, still a little bit warmer out towards Charleston, sitting at 79 degrees. Again, I anticipate that we should stay mainly dry as we head through the rest of the night, and we will hang on to partly cloudy skies, but we do bring back those rain and storm chances for tomorrow. We'll talk more about that. And of course, we'll take a look at that beach forecast just in case you want to hit the beach first thing in the morning. That's coming up here in just a little while.